Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the first Android 11 ROM for a Redmi Note 5 Pro or the Redmi Note 5 AI. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So guys, this is Lineage OS 18, which is the first Android 11 based ROM for a Redmi Note 5 Pro or the Redmi Note 5 AI. Let's take a look at the About phone. It says Android version 11, obviously. Android security update is September 5, 2020. And the kernel we get is the extended kernel. So guys, this is the first build of Lineage OS 18 and it's quite stable, like everything, almost everything which needs to be worked is working. Uh, Cell Linux is permissive, obviously, uh, first builds it will be enforcing, you know, after all the Daniels have been fixed. And also, uh, good experiment is not working. Mine is FPC, uh, as you can see, my fingerprint is working. Mine is FPC module and you can check it with the device uh, info hardware. And here you can see go into fingerprint and you can just see if it, yours is the FPC or GoodX. And if you're GoodX, then it won't work. And the developer has already fixed that issue and he may push a new build. So if it's a new build, then I will obviously post that link or then I will update it later. And I will just bin a comment so that you guys can know about it. So guys, all the major things are working fine like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, uh, mobile data, VOLTE, location. And as you can see, hotspot is also working fine and Wi-Fi plus hotspot thing is also working fine so there are no issues with that and calling and everything is fine Google Play Store works fine there are Android RG apps already by Nick G apps and Flame G apps you can flash anything on your own I will just post a link about it in the description also as you can see guys the battery backup is amazing idle drain is 0% at all I'm using it for just uh, you know casual things uh, I haven't game yet you know I have installed the game but I did not game yet uh, I didn't get time but yeah I will surely post it down in the description if there are any issues really regarding that if I do gaming and yeah everything else is fine uh, only thing is not working is good fingerprint and cell Linux is permissive and that is okay like for some things you know so for some people they need cell Linux permissive for some mods uh, sound mods and all that stuff so that is fine for me and also lineage OS features will be added soon like the lineage OS trust uh, privacy guard and the lineage OS uh, live display uh, which is also a lineage OS feature so that will be added too uh, slowly slowly as you know just you know adding up things uh, it's not possible with a new uh, android version release so yeah slowly slowly everything will be added it will uh, you know keep getting stable google will also uh, add some patches to uh, monthly patches uh, with monthly updates and security updates too so yeah let's wait and let's see how much time it takes to uh, actually uh, became stable and actually there are really less changes from android q to android r everything is getting updated quickly all the device like almost all devices have booted android r without any issues and also gsis are available so that is really amazing like any old phone with treble support or new phones all already have treble any old ported treble like for my j7 screen has treble and it is already running android r so that's amazing so yeah Android R ROMs, uh, like we will get it stable by maybe I just guess one month. So yeah, that's it for now. Also guys, the camera works fine. We have this uh, normal Google camera by default and Gcam should work fine. It works fine on my Redmi Note 7 Pro. And I don't have any idea about the ANX cam, but yeah, you can just, uh, you know, try it and see if it's working fine. I'm just, you know, not been experimenting uh, right now because just wanted to uh, show everything as stock so guys that was it now let's move to the installation uh, right away so you have to first power off the device so uh, and yeah the power menu is a bit different here so getting confused so power your device and boot it into recovery mode using the power up and volume uh, sorry the volume up and the power buttons so guys, I'm using the pitch black recovery you can use any custom recovery you just make sure you are using the latest version of it and yeah latest oh sorry about that and wipe uh, this stuff also i'm decrypted uh, i don't know if encryption works i will just update it in the description but don't worry just back up your internal storage all your important data now go to install and you have to select the lineage or zip add more zips and i'm directly flashing magisk uh, you can also flash the gfs and now, now while installation i don't want to you know just make the boot longer you know, while switching to the next ROM so yeah so that's it just flash magic scannery I will just link the magic scannery in the description so you can just easily download it and yeah let's skip this thing 
and the installation is successful reboot system and you can enjoy lineage os 18 right away on your redmi note 5 pro so there is one uh, issue if you are using g apps so yeah if you're using g apps you have to go to gms disable sms service and then again enable it uh, there is some rom side issue with it and also i'm using the nick g apps so i have to do it i don't know if it uh, is fine for other g apps like the flame g apps also so yep that is it and if you guys have liked this video press the like button if not press the dislike button also hit the subscribe button in the red one please uh, make it gray press the button subscribe and yeah also you can follow my instagram and twitter it's in the description you can just go down there check other stuff and yeah that is it uh, bye bye i will meet you guys with some other video uh till then bye bye